What's up? Welcome to another Frank Family Vlogs. Our baby is cute. Yes, he is. What are we doing today? It is October. It's getting a little chilly outside. I'm still wearing a tank top, but that's all right. And we're going to decorate for Halloween. So come on, let's go. <laughs> we have so much stuff that is in our, we call the Christmas tray room. So we're going to go down there and get it, bring it upstairs and then transform. You'll hardly recognize the front of our house. Let's go. All right, so this is all of our Halloween, Christmas, and holiday stuff. I think Halloween is right here, so let's just take it all up. Get it. Mom and Dad are putting the uh, twinkle lights on the roof. I think this is gonna look so good. Baby's looking cute as ever. I love you. <gasps> Hi. <laughs> so stinky. So if you're, uh, if you live in Nashville, we're expecting to see you on Halloween night. No, we're not. Don't come to our house, David. Don't. Say <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing, you bud? Me? What are you doing? He hears you. He's just busy with his... Oh, no, I don't want it. I don't... No, I don't... No, thank you. <laughs> What's he doing? Well, I remember these from last year. Kathy's the expert on bush lighting. <laughs> Thank you. Not sponsored by Bush Light. Wow, that looks great. Oh my God, and you got the inflatable too. Okay, I decided to add a little bit of a flare to our bedroom too. So I put this little orange throw right here. This was actually the ribbon that <laughs> this was wrapped up in and I just tied it there. And then a little pumpkin spice thing, orange lights, and Halloween in our bedroom. some lights. Let's go. some more lights you can't really see but I had to order more because that side of the house looks sadly dark how much
exciting day. Early in the morning, eight o'clock. I know I'm crazy, but I am finally getting my hair done. Oh my God. I am so in need. I don't think I've had my roots done in like a year. It's so hard not to scratch. She's mixing up the color now. This is the weird in-between stage, but I don't know, it looks kind of cool. All right, final product. I am so excited. This is so pretty. Look at that, no roots, no roots. Oh, it's bouncy. I'm happy, very, very excited. This, I feel like this is the best color and style and like everything that my hair's been in years. It feels freaking good, yeah. <laughs> hey Nala. Hey Nala. You want to help me put this out? Come on. Ah. All right. Very cute. Right, Nala? Yeah. Good girl. Now this is going to sound silly, but I have sort of an emotional attachment to things. Like sometimes I get connected to um, places or items, along with people, obviously, but um, a few of the items that I, ooh, freaking sunset, um, a few of the items that I am sentimental towards, um, it might be time to put away. This reminds me of when I did the uh, video where I put Ash's clothes back in boxes, his like zero to three month clothes. But this swing, even though he still technically fits like the weight requirements for it, he just doesn't want to be in it. Uh, it never gets used. So it literally just sits in this corner of our house and collects dust. This is the corner we put our Christmas tree in. And I think for now I might put the, uh, the ball pit there. So our decorations are looking good. Yeah, hey. So the swing, I talked to David about this um, and he said, which made me feel so much better right away. He suggested we put it in the basement, which means, you know, technically it could still be used. So we're not putting it away. We're just moving it, right? <laughs> Um, and while I'm on that train, I might as well just continue and <sighs> I don't even want to say it. This, it's time for this to go. I just have so many memories, nap times and him being just so little and cute that it's so hard. This is just hard for me. People probably think I'm crazy for being sentimental over a bedside sleeper. Um, but this is what he slept in every night for a long time. This is no longer safe for him because once babies can stand up, they can basically crawl over it, which he's kind of attempted to do a few times unsuccessfully, but I don't want to risk it. But other than that, it has been a great place for storage. We have put all kinds of clothes in here and toys and just crap we throw in here. Um, so it's basically just a spot to hold junk at this point. So it is time. I'm gonna put this in a closet and fill it with some toys that he's also outgrown. Cause I have several toys like, ah, oh, I hate this. It was the one that was like, maybe you could be a purple monkey in a bubble gum tree. And that part at least, see, and this is me trying to just procrastinate on him growing up, but I'm keeping the little keyboard part of it and just putting the tummy time part away. But I have other like tummy time sort of things that just don't, you know, he just not gonna use them anymore. I'm sorry. <laughs> Is this Halloween vlog worthy? I don't know, but it's just what we're doing at this time in our life. You know, it's halfway through October at this point, a little over halfway. And um, these are things that we're experiencing in our life. So I'm sharing them with you. And now I'm gonna go harass David and have him help me carry everything upstairs. <laughs> He loves playing with that. You ready? I'm ready. A cute spot. All right, we just finished getting ready to go. We have a music class today. I've actually, I've not vlogged about this, but I've been taking Ash to a little music class with a bunch of other little babies and kids. It's so sweet. We've been going every Friday and uh, we're about to head out right now with my new hair <laughs> and my sleepy eyes because this morning we had a little bit of a, um, actually <laughs> the last several mornings, we've had some uh, commotion by the cutest little alarm clock ever.
I'll have to explain that later because that's a whole, that's a story that it, there's just, there's so many cats. I just, another vlog. You want his cookie? <laughs> you can't have it. Yes, you have a cookie. Mm -hmm. All right, so here we have clearly labeled front door lights, smart. Four smart ones. Let's do it. You gonna help mama? I don't really like you touching these. These are glass. Hey, what if I give you another cookie and I'll put these up? Sound good to you? Sweet, dude. Sweet. How's that cookie, bud? How's that cookie, bud? We have now put in all the smart lights. They're flashing because they are trying to connect. So I have to stop vlogging because I'm on my phone and connect them to my phone and then we can make them any color we want, bud. What do you want? Purple? Orange? What color do you want? Anything you want, bud, you can pick. Good. Looks pretty spooky. No, don't show that. There we go. <laughs> Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. Nice shirt. Oh, uh, is this still relevant? Yeah. I'm still a groom? Yeah. It is our two year wedding anniversary. How old are you? A one. Ah! <laughs> yeah. Oh. Ah! We've had a productive couple years, uh, but we're doing brunch and then we're doing dinner later. Yeah, buddy. And Daddy made breakfast for you. Look, look. What you making? What you making? I made three. Oh, you yeah. better eat it. You better eat that or Daddy gonna be pissed off at you, buddy. Yeah, or we'll eat his leftovers. Oh, I hate this. Ah! I'm so cool, I did it by myself. Yeah. Is that yummy, honey munch? Mm. I have procrastinated long enough on this and I'm sort of sad I don't want to do it because I remember setting this up and being very pregnant and like laying down next to it, putting my hand in it, imagining that one day it would have a baby. And then I remember all his cute little nap times of him sleeping in here. Give us a couple years and then hopefully we'll have to bust this bad boy back out. But for now, for now it goes in the closet. Ouch. All right, there it is. Bye bye, bedside sleeper. In the closet. Come on, bedside sleeper. He could jump out of it. He could probably jump into it and then out of it. <laughs> Who's the cutest little pumpkin 
<laughs> Oogie Boogie Man in the world. Oh yes, no, beanies don't last very long on him. Decorating for Halloween was lots and lots of fun. I added some more lights there and everything looks super cute. The house is beautifully decorated for Halloween. We love it. I got some orange candles going too. It's the details, but we're going to end this vlog and the next one, the very, very next one, the very next one is going to be Halloween. So you can see what we're both gonna be for Halloween. You can see all of our fun festivities. I'm actually leaving right now to go to the airport to pick up daddy because he's been at Vegas doing a festival over the weekend, the one we were young thing. We've been hanging here partying, watched Hocus Pocus. So we're gonna pick up daddy and then a few hours later, we're gonna pick up your auntie and your nana. My mom and sister are coming. So they're gonna be here for Halloween again this year like they were last year. And it's gonna be so much fun. So thanks for watching. Like this video if you liked my decorations. Aww. That's sweet. Do you like mommy's decorations? Me too. So like this video, likes really do help a lot. Leave a comment below, let me know what you think. Do we need more inflatables in the yard? I think we do. Thank you to everybody supporting us on Patreon, patreon.com slash Jacqueline and David. And those of you getting merch at our merch store, ffemerch.com. See you later. <laughs> Woo!